Ladies and gentlemen, back for the second year, our Master of Ceremonies, co-hosting the morning show. Please put your hands together for Larry Emder. Thank you. Good evening, oh, good evening everybody, and welcome back. It's lovely to be here uh, for the second time. Thank you very much uh, for having me back. I, I feel guilty. I feel terribly guilty that during the night I'm asking you to look this way. When in fact one of the greatest festivals in the world is just out that window there. All these amazing things happening over there and I'm asking you to look at this busted old thing up here. So um, thank you very much for your patience. It was lovely to hear from the minister downstairs. We'll see if he's still smiling when he gets the electrical bill from Vivid. Uh, I think he will be. It's uh, great to see you again. This truly is uh, an amazing venue for us tonight. It was fabulous uh, that we got a chance to make our way through uh, the incredible displays downstairs and we will be able to go back down there and spend some more time there on our way to the after party shortly. So officially welcome to Australia's Good Design Awards. Uh, this year the guiding inspiration for the awards is Design for a Better Australia and a More Prosperous World. And tonight we celebrate the very best in Australian and international design and innovation and we honour the true pioneers and the game changers who are not only shaping their industries, but also the world in which we live. This is a landmark year for the Good Design Awards, folks, as we celebrate seven unique categories of design, including business model design, communication design, digital design, architectural design, service design, product design, and social innovation. I'm also thrilled to tell you that 2016 has been the biggest year for these awards so far, with more than 400 amazing, truly amazing projects submitted and over 600 people gathered here tonight. It's terrific to see you all. These awards would not be possible, of course, without the support of our valued design-driven partners, DNSW, Vivid Sydney, Deloitte, Road Microphones, DS Automobiles, SAE Creative Media Institute, The Explainers and Light Tape Australia, proudly presented by Lime Lighting. Please give them all a round of applause and thank them for their support all tonight. Have a look around downstairs, an amazing array of products. Great to see the uh, Tesla Model S, uh, last year's design award uh, of the year. Um, as, at the entrance as we walked in. It's a magnificent motor car. We should be incredibly proud of our achievements and tonight we celebrate the design heritage that has and is, continues to shape our great country. Now to start off the evening, uh, this is a real treat for us. With her debut single, Hold, I'd like to welcome one of the country's brightest rising stars straight from her own headline tour and uh, touring with Matt Corby through Sydney, Newcastle, Canberra and Melbourne. Please, ladies and gentlemen, wait, make welcome Zero Blue. Thank you. <laughs> I'm going to do a song for you called Hold, which is my first single.
Thank you, Vera. Please, another round of applause for Vera Blue. They'll be back a little bit later on. All right, ladies and gentlemen, before we, uh, before we start the awards, if I can have your attention, please. Before we start the awards, I'd like to uh, welcome to the lectern now, and I'd like you to give him a huge round of applause, the man without whom none of this, none of this would be possible. The CEO of Good Design Australia, Dr. Brandon Gien. Australia's Good Design Awards for 2016. The patron of Good Design Australia, Mr. Harad Foster, thank you for being with us tonight. Our chair, Maureen Thurston. Our guest of honour, Mr. I'm sorry, not Mr. Professor Mugendi Umtwaritha, the president of the World Design Organisation, who will be presenting the Good Design Award of the Year later this evening. Mugendi, thank you very, very much for taking the time out of your incredibly busy schedule to be with us here tonight. To the members of our... Yes, this man travels all over the world and I think he's been living out of a suitcase for the last five years, so it's, it is very special to have you here. Uh, to the members of our, our jury panel uh, who are here, I want to give an enormous thank you for all your time and your effort and your dedication over the last couple of days to assess the amazing projects that we've had into the, into the, into the awards this year. Thank you very, very much for your time and thanks for being here tonight. I, um, I just want to make a special welcome to a few of our international uh, judges. Mr. Dong Hoon Chan, the president of Samsung Design Institute. Thank you for coming here from South Korea. <laughs> Mr. Harold Leschke, the former head of advanced design from Mercedes-Benz, all the way from Bulgaria. Uh, ben Wilson from the Corporate Design Center at Procter & Gamble in Germany. Thank you. And also the legendary Paul Priestman, uh, co-founder and creative director of Priestman Good, 
uh, from the United Kingdom. Paul, thank you for coming all the way here to Australia. Dr. Larry Marshall, the uh, CEO of CSIRO. Larry, thank you for being here. Ms. Do Ms. Dolly Merrilese, the uh, Director of the Museum of Applied Arts and Sciences. Joanne Kellogg, the Executive Director of the Australian Design Alliance. And Julie Hobbs, the National President of the Design Institute of Australia. I also would like to thank our, our sponsors and partners, uh, Mr. Kai Brzezovic, uh, the General Manager of DS Automobiles, the official vehicle partner of Good Design Australia, Mr. Peter Friedman, the CEO of Road, who are the proud sponsors of our Young Australian Design Awards, and Ms. Ursula Brennan, a partner of Deloitte Access Economics, who gener generously support our Social Innovation Awards category. And finally, Mr. Lee Aiken from the SAE Institute, Media Institute, Thank you for your unwavering support of these important awards. I also just want to take a minute to, um, to thank our amazing team who have worked so hard to put this event together. The brilliant team at Sense Events, you know who you are. Mitch Morgan, my very dedicated team at Good Design Australia, Catherine Kung and Rachel Y. Thank you guys for everything you've done and the long hours that you've worked to put this incredible night together. The future belongs to those who can imagine it and design it. We are living in a, massive, in a time of massive change. Our world population is fast approaching 9 billion people and by 2050, 70% of these people are going to be living in our cities. Our world is crying out for better ways and a better future for our younger generations. Designers make the world better. That's what we do. They are driven not only to make better things, but to make things better. They view our world through an optimistic lens where problems are seen as challenges and challenges are seen as opportunities. That is exactly what these awards are all about. For more than 50 years, they have showcased the best examples of design and innovation from the smallest products that we use every day, the services and experience that we encounter, the buildings and spaces that we inhabit, and the society that we live in. Design touches absolutely everything. Most importantly, design helps us imagine a better, a more sustainable, and a more balanced world. It doesn't matter if you are an industrial designer, a digital designer, an interaction designer, an engineer, an architect, a scientist, or an entrepreneur. A good imagination is what it takes to imagine a better world and make it possible. Tonight is a celebration of the imaginative minds that have designed the incredible projects that we see downstairs. Tonight is your night to shine. Enjoy it. Thank you.